Well, it certainly did complicate it um, because um, color does not run at the same speed as black and white. Uh, black and white used to run at what is known as 60 cycles a second. They don't use the term cycles anymore. They changed it to Hertz after Heinrich Hertz, and that was kind of an honor for him. So his name became the word cycle. So 60 Hertz is the way, that's what you have coming out of your wall plug is 60 cycles or 60 Hertz. When color came in, uh, in order to get the color, add the color information to the black and white picture, and I'm not an engineer, but uh, they had to slow it down ever so slightly to 59.94 cycles per second instead of 60. And that's how we were able to get color information added to the black and white picture. And that caused us a problem because when we were using this double system method of editing videotape, uh, we had to have a special 10,000 watt generator that would run at this new speed, 59.94 uh, hertz per second, in order for the everything to maintain a time frame that would match exactly with the videotape because that's the speed that the tape ran. So yes, uh, it did it did pose a problem, but it relatively easy to overcome.